Hi everyone, I'm Sharon Smith, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can edit your YouTube video subtitles so that it has the correct capitalization and punctuation. We're going to use ChatGPT to help us with this task. Let's take a look. So here we are in Creator Studio. I'm over here on my content tab, and I'm just going to select the edit button on one of the videos where I need to add my subtitles and edit them for the correct capitalization and punctuation. So over here on the details, I'm going to come down and click on subtitles. And then over here on the uh, subtitles area, hover your mouse and then click on the pencil icon over here to duplicate and edit. It'll ask if we want to overwrite and just click continue. And then over here, YouTube has speech to text software that will generate your transcript for you, which is awesome. But notice that it generates all of the transcript of the spoken audio that is in your video, but it doesn't have any of the punctuation or capitalization that we need. So rather than going through this and trying to do it manually, we're going to go ahead and just select the entire transcript. I'm going to hit control C to copy, and then we're going to come over to chat GPT and the prompt that I'm using Using to do this is without changing any of the words, can you add punctuation and capitalization to this video transcript so that I can create captions? Then I'm going to place my cursor. I'm going to hit shift enter, and then I'm going to hit control V and paste the entire transcript. And I'm going to hit enter. And then ChatGPT will come back and generate the transcript with all of the correct punctuation without changing any of the words in your transcript. All right, now if you have a really long transcript, sometimes ChatGPT gets hung up and kind of stops in the middle. So you're going to want to make sure you say keep generating or prompt it and ask it to finish the rest of the transcript for you. So it'll be the entire thing. Then all you have to do is copy that and I'm going to hit control C and I like to paste this into a blank word document. And once I have this in a blank word document, I can go through if there is anything that I need to find and replace, I can do that here in Microsoft word. And one thing I like to do is remove all of the different spaces that ChatGPT puts into the transcript. So I'm just going to take a moment and delete all of those. All right, now I'm going to select the entire transcript again and hit copy, control C to copy. And we're going to come back over into our video over here. And I'm going to delete the generated transcript and I'm going to hit control V to copy and replace it with the proper capitalization and punctuation for our transcript. And then all we have to do is click on edit timings and then YouTube will automatically place all of the timings for you for your captions. And if you want to, you can hit play and watch through just to make sure that the timings look good and then hit publish when you're ready to publish. Now what we can do is watch the video on YouTube. Once my video starts playing, I can come down here and click on the closed captions. And I notice that my properly capitalized and punctuated subtitles are showing up for my captions. I'm going to pause this and just one more quick note that you can do this for a video that you haven't yet published. So I'm, I did this on a public video, so you can go back and do this to all of your existing videos that you've already published, or you can do it to a video that you haven't published yet. Once it has time to upload, then the speech to text will generate that transcript for you. You'll be able to do this process and save it and edit those timings for all of your videos. If you found this video helpful, be sure and share it with all your friends and give it a thumbs up to like it. You can subscribe to my channel and click the bell to receive a notification every time I post a new video. Be sure and visit my website at SharonSmithHR.com. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.